How are you enjoying this atmosphere? It's insane. Oh, I love it. It's my wife, so it's, I don't know. She, I lost her. She's gone. Um, uh, it's her first time doing one of these with me, uh, and I like, I like, kind of thrive. And you get to like, I feel like I meet a lot of people that I correspond with on the internet for like years, and then suddenly it's like I meet Marshmallow. I'm like, oh, what's up, tight? And we hug, and it's the best. Like these are the best moments. So I love these. Wait, do you reach out to them on social media? Is is that what you're talking? We hit each other up. Yeah, yeah. It's like, oh, we got to do a song together. Oh yeah, totally. And we like DM for like a year, and then suddenly you're meeting. Them. and it's usually one of these things like I, I finally met Khalid is like the most cuddly amazing human and we met for the first time at a similar event thing and now every time we're on one of these it's just like a nice hug it's tasty yeah All right. I have to look, be honest with you like I've never heard of somebody like actually making it work successfully of just directly messaging someone and making it work what is your secret for all the people who are out there who are like I want to collaborate with this person how do I go about approaching them without them like turning me away what's your what is your What's your magic? I'm definitely very honest and it doesn't always work and that's okay. Like I think if you're just a fan, like truly if you're into somebody's thing, give them love, tell them how tight their stuff is, maybe they'll do it to you, whatever, and then suddenly you'll make something together. Sometimes I do it and somebody doesn't ever reach back and that's fine too. You gotta just keep putting yourself out there and be okay to be rejected, I guess. And that's life. I admire your hustle, 100%. Oh, I appreciate that, baby. Is there someone that maybe you haven't corresponded with, but you would like to meet with the hope of collaborating with? You know, um, that's a great question. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say Cardi B for tonight. She's like on my tongue a lot. I'm a New Yorker diehard, and she's oh yes, boo boo. Knicks go Knicks, even when or Nets, <laughs> even when they aren't doing so well. Um, but uh, but yeah, uh, uh, Cardi B for sure. I love uh, I love everything. I love who she is. I love that she just is unapologetic about who she is, whether someone hates it or not. And uh, and I've been you know I've rep New York so hard. It'd be amazing to create something together and just get spicy, get fun size, spicy, slay the game, represent Hell's Kitchen and the. Bronx. Are you Hell's Kitchen too? No way. That's all I rep. 43rd and 10th Avenue. Boo boo. You're like three blocks from my house. What? 43rd and 10th you, did you did you like uh, Manhattan Plaza? Where did you grow up? No. No. Um. No. Right. Um. Next to uh to like uh Heaven and Hell. Plaza. Yeah. Yeah. Right there. Alicia Keys. Wow, we're gonna talk. I don't want to give my address away, so we'll talk after I finish this interview. But um, but yeah, no, I carry New York everywhere. I, I wrote, you know, I wrote my song "Lights Down Low" about my wife Emily, and uh, and and I we got married in Hell's Kitchen, and so it's uh, it's really beautiful. They're showcasing the song tonight on the awards, and and uh, and I love I Heart a lot, and and Muse is tight too, so slay hey, and uh, yeah, I love it. Who are you excited to see perform tonight? That you're kind of like, ah, oh, I really want to perform with this person. Oh my gosh! Well, besides the Cardi B one. Um, let me think. I, I think um, I've always been a fan of Maroon 5. I really love Adam Levine. He went to my camp, which was called Frenchwood. Shout out Frenchwood. And, um, and I just, I've always admired him as a vocalist, as, a, as an artist. And now I'm excited to see them perform. Tell me about your music. What are you working on? What do you want people to know is coming down the pipeline? Well, you'll be happy to know my next song is about New York. So we out here. Hell's Kitchen. Um, it's with my friend Joey Badass. And, uh, and it's, um, it's all about... Uh, just being still New York wherever we go because in this life I feel like I'm rarely home I'm traveling everywhere to do music and and you gotta you gotta keep your roots wherever you're from you have to hold them with you because it's easy to forget where it all came from so that's what the song's about it's coming out soon and uh, yeah where can we find it it's gonna be it's gonna be on all this stuff Spotify all the tasty things but right now Lights Down Low is out there and my record Hell's Kitchen Angel is out there and uh, so yeah hope you guys check it out and uh, download it legally or illegally I don't care as long as you're listening slay Thank you so much for your time. Thanks, I appreciate man. it. No, Thank you for watching Muse. If you like what you saw, make sure to subscribe to our channel and click on all the other videos you see to watch more of our content.